Hey kiddos, it's Miss Trace again. Here we go with The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carl. Let's find out what this very hungry caterpillar is going to eat. Nope, oh, maybe. Alright, here's... This is for my sister Krista. Let's see. In the light of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop, out of the egg came a tiny and very hungry caterpillar. He started to look for some food. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, he ate through, let's find out how many. One, two, three, four. Four strawberries, but he was still hungry. Let's see. On Friday, he ate through how many? One, two, three, four. Five. Five oranges. But he was still hungry. Well, on Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and one slice of watermelon. That night, he had a stomach ache. Yeah, there's a lot for a little guy to eat. The next day was Sunday again. The little cat, caterpillar ate through one nice green leaf. And after that, he felt much better. Now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was a big, fat caterpillar. He built a small house called a cocoon around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon and pushed his way out and... <gasps> he was a beautiful butterfly. That was an awesome book.